Mashi, congratulations on your 150th, mate. Um, it's been great playing with you over all these years. Um, very happy to be there on Saturday with you, and uh, you're a true lion. Um, I think you're doing a great job as coach as well this year, so hopefully we can uh, have a really successful year and win the flag for you. Yeah, Lloyd, uh, shout out I can't be playing with you this week, but yeah, congratulations. You've done a great job with the club this year and uh, been a great mentor for me since the last three or four years that I've been with the club. So just like to say congratulations and uh, yeah, hope it's a successful win for the club and you. Good luck, Mashi. Uh, just like to tell a story out of my, my words, of, uh, words of wisdom. When I was uh, batting with a young player, yet not to be named, I. Uh, Last over the day, decided not to not to take a single out of the demon wicket. I uh, put my hand up and said, "No, nah, I don't think so, pal." End of the ball, the kid said, "Oh, uh, mate, why did you uh, not take that single?" He goes, "Protect the pro, son. Protect the pro." Happy one fifty, Lloyd. Highlights of El Mesh. Welcome everyone, um, back again uh, in our Club Legends series. Um, last time we were talking about Ben Waterman, this time we've got him as a, a special guest uh, to honour uh, Lloyd Match's 150th this week. And uh, Ben, who, who knows him, I'd say best, and just picked him to the post of me making his 150th, courtesy of probably a few state games uh, <laughs> in, 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 in between. So, Mashy, some highlights. From his, his illustrious Yeah, I think it's been a few highlights from actually. Obviously, there's you know, the, the big ones, obviously, playing Victorian, representing uh, the club, playing the flag. Um, Mate here, you know, 170 is his highest score, but something that he always sort of goes back to is, is uh, his three poles. He loves talking about his three wickets. Uh, they roll off the tongue, Jewel, Harrison, and DeWitt. How many and, times have you heard that? Yeah, no, we've heard it a few times, Faggy. We've heard it, definitely heard it a few times. And uh, he likes to throw in that uh, there was two captains in that as well. So. Enough. Not send offs, but uh, he went from bowling sort of two or three overs a week to then bowling sort of 14, 15, so, and having the title Captain Harold on it. So, a yeah. few interesting decisions, but uh, when you skip it, you can get away with it. So, there, there's some highlights, and we, and we all know that stuff. He's had, he's had a great career, everyone around the, the traps knows that. Low lights? Probably uh, Mashi's lowest hour, and uh, I think he'd uh, agree with this is when he uh, won the, the sixth Dang Award, and he managed to. Uh, the inaugural. <laughs> the inaugural. <laughs> this is drove up six dangs in a year, uh, which included a double dang down at Frankston and outright. And uh, at that stage, there was no East Link, so we just had to sit in silence all the way up Springvale Road. So probably not match his finest out, but he's bounced back a great man with uh, with a few other good performances. So yeah. now Mashi is uh, is renowned as a very very clean cut character, and uh, you know everyone uh, doesn't have a bad word to say about him. Now, you've been the closest to him over a number of years. Indiscretions. Probably my favourite part, I reckon, Faggy, because he does present this image, but uh, in his younger days, perhaps didn't tick the right box all the time. Uh, it was a pretty serious character as well. One day we were playing at Fitzroy in the, in the seconds in our early days. I uh, had to face sort of five hours before stumps. We were playing uh, against the, the big quick nanners from Hawthorne at that stage, and uh, last ball of the day, I'm actually got nipped out. It's fair to say he was a little bit uh, disgruntled, and uh, so we jumped in the car. At this stage, he had the uh, I think the 1979 Kingswood, yeah. uh, purple Kingswood, and we, we flew out of Strands, not a word spoken again. And as we were coming into Williamson's Road, did a massive burnout, uh, only to be pulled over by the police, sort of a couple of minutes up the road, and uh, not a lot of words from uh, Doncaster to Eltham, uh, Mash again. Sounds like, sounds like a fair bit of your friendship has just been you two just sitting next to each other in silence. And as they say, that's one of the, the signs of great friendship, when you can just sit there in silence. I think one of those times uh, when we sat in silence, when um, I'm actually never a lot to say again, moving from the club, my uh, lovely partner Claire came to pick us up one night and, um, and to repay the favour, I'm actually uh, decided to vomit all over her uh, three day old car as well. So. As we say, Mash, uh, you can keep it clean for, for a lot of the time, but uh, the skeletons jump out of the closet at, at times, Mashy, and uh, we know that uh, sometimes it, you've got up to a bit of mischief. It's just good to let everyone else know, isn't it? 
Think so? Yeah. Being, the, being the, the captain coach, the, yeah. the, the esteemed figure of the club. This is not for some years. Uh, this, yeah, is, this, is, uh, this, is, this is the old mash. The yeah, old mash. The old mash. Yeah. But uh, I, th- I think, um, obviously, a bit of, bit of fun there, Mashy, but um, I don't know, we've shared some great times at the club. Uh, he's been a fantastic servant to the club and uh, a very loyal member and someone who, who loves the club dearly. Uh, with some great performances, and I think it's terrific what you've done this year with, um, with your captain coach's role, and uh, I know you're going to make it more successful for the year to come, and hopefully a flag at the end of the year. So, congratulations on a fantastic career today, and uh, hopefully some more success in the future. Yeah, no, definitely uh, reiterate those those words, and uh, no, it's been great to, to play with you for for all my years uh, at the club, and just been great to. I have you as a, as a leader uh, over, the, over the time, but also as captain coach uh, this year. You've done a great job with the, with the kids. Um, so, yeah, it's good to have you so close as well. And always, you know, wanting to check up and see how things are going. Always so, smiling. Always, yeah, always, smiling. always smiling and always happy to be around. So, uh, well done, mate. Uh, top work and, uh, yeah, good luck.